What is this? Sean. I'm sorry. Whoever she was having the affair with was here with her. Oh my God. Everybody get out of here! Take cover! Want to explain to me what the hell happened last night? Okay, I just want to go on record and say that I was on that couch first. I don't even know what that's supposed to mean. Well, ex excuse me, may I help you? My beef ain't with you, lady. I need to talk to these two cats right here. Mother of God, it's Ed Lover. Mr. Spencer, what is Ed Lover doing in my office? I guess your mother never taught you about taking another grown ass man's bling. Wait, that's your bling? That's my brand, player. You took Ed Lover's blink? I don't remember doing it, I swear. Come on, son. You know damn well you swiped my ultra bright while I was on the dance floor getting my freak on. Who the hell is Ed Lover? Come Good on, boy, son. I apologize for my dad's life. Sean and I are huge fans, Mr. Ed Lover, in case we didn't mention it last night. Huh? I should whip both of your narrow asses. Wasted half my day tracking you down. Come on, son. Get the hell out of here with that bolt. Did that? Was he? <laughs> what a night! What a night! Okay, please tell me that that is going to be the last interruption. Now, people. <laughs> What's up, baby? Listen, Mr. Guster, we're all happy that you can manage to captivate the honeys or whatever it is, but right now you are on my time. Can you hold on one second? Actually, Chief, I'm on my time. I almost lost my life an hour ago, and I'm sick of it. Last night, Gus had it right, and I don't want to sit here wasting another moment when I could be living the life I was meant to live, balling and shot calling. So if you don't mind, I'm going to keep it one honey and take this call. But I'm sorry, Sean. It's hard out there for a pimp. It's true, Chief. You just got to make money for the rent. I'm not even going to bring up. The destruction of Bobo, the donut man. Uh, Chief, if I may, uh, in lieu of flowers, donations can be made to glazedforlife.com. Ow! Oh, I'll get you. Stop it! You I know will what? destroy you! This is not a joke, Mr. Spencer. That explosion was meant to kill, and the killer is still out there. And Henry Spencer, where are your pants? I'm not entirely sure, Karen. Her name is Gloria Williams, Chief, and she couldn't have gotten far. We have contacted every transportation agency in an effort to slow her down. Then what are we doing still sitting here? 